Hi guys, and welcome back to another Gab's Cryptocurrency video where we trade by data and not by hype. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, click the subscribe button down below and hit the notification bell so you won't miss out daily technical analysis like this. And as you can see, we can still provide pa din yung ating previous and traditional format ng Gab's Crypto. Yung debate dati may in this video tayo, tapos intro video, and then some short recap kung ano ba yung, or summary kung ano yung pag-usapan natin for the whole video kasi... Ngayon, wala pa din yung aking laptop. So, I'm still using a temporary laptop for now, which is itong lumang MacBook ko. But yeah, it's still looking good pa din naman. So, I can still provide pa din daily updates. Yun nga lang, hindi siya yung tulad ng lumang format na ginagawa natin. But yeah, let's now dive into this video. And we're going to talk about these two things ngayon. That is, number one, yung ating short-term time frame movement, which is the 15-minute time frame we are seeing an opportunity. And number two, we are going to look at other indicators for the very short term kasi we are seeing this next potential move for us which we can take advantage so now let's dive into that analysis and the ba i think with this analysis what we are actually expecting is just more consolidation but then because we are not seeing any massive sign of a clear bullish or bearish trend reversal and the ba sinasabi ko sa inyo in the four time frame wala tayong nakikita ng ganung movement yet so i'm still expecting more consolidation dito and Ang mas maganda kasi mangyayari dito is dapat meron tayong bullish divergence sa bigger time frame in order for us to see a massive move talaga. But right now, what is happening dito sa ating very short term? So if we're going to zoom in sa ating 15-minute time frame, let's try to zoom in and take a look at this, guys. Zoom in tayo sa 15-minute. You can see na we are forming right now a rising wedge within the 15-minute time frame. And traditionally, a rising wedge is a bearish pattern to the downside so right now i'm leaning bearish for the very short term so this can be a very quick trade right now with the bitcoin price action and take note guys i'll be opening this next trade kay buy bit so make sure to use my sign up link and you can find the description down below if you don't want to miss this next trade and also i'll be trading this ating copy trade account so make sure to follow our copy trade account it's in the description down below then but yeah right now that is what we are currently seeing and i'll be magiging targets at dito so there are three ways on how we can we play this so number one is yung una yung short position dito stop loss is around the 19,000 or uh, i sorry 16,890 US dollars around that area so dun yung aking current stop loss and then naka-open tayo na short position up until the following areas first target would be the 16,600 second target would be the 16,500 but our last and final target is around the 16,200 so this can be a very big move for us to take advantage of. Let's see, we're going to trade this for the very short term. So, ano ba yung magiging strategy natin? Usual, as long as nag-open natin dito ng short position. Ang kailangan kasi natin makita is magkaroon ng sell volume. So, ayun, medyo kulang yung sell volume natin. So, in this case, we are going to set a stop loss dito para if ever this leads into a fake out, let's secure natin yung ating capital. But yeah, right now, we're going to open a short position up until... The following areas nga. So first, if we meet the 16,600, then yung ating stop loss, yung adjust natin siya into a trail stop. Then if let's say na-meet natin yung next area natin, adjust the trail stop into another trail stop. And then if let's say na-meet natin yung final target, then yung ating pinakam take profit area natin dito with the Bitcoin price action. And just to add more analysis dito for the very short term, kasi if you're going to look at this in the early time frame, itong rising wedge na yan, you can see na yung ating Stochastic RSI and MACD are all forming a bearish momentum dito and a bearish cross. So right now, we might be seeing a potential trend reversal for the very short term muna. So take note, this is just for the very short term and not, not for the long term. So I think we can see this movement play out long for the time being dito for the very short term muna with the Bitcoin price action. And take note guys, uh, in muna update natin for the time being. So yun yung nakikita natin trade. And make sure to follow our Gabal Football Club page kasi ito yung ating Gabal FC page. And Gabal FC is actually a football club dito sa ating YouTube channel. And ayun na, may, mga free, may mga games tayo upcoming this Saturday at McKinley Stadium in Taguig City. And as you can see, Gabal FC is actually top 1 sa standings ngayon. Pretty good for our new team. And ayun na, top 1 tayo ngayon. And... Make sure guys now watch our games because if you're going to watch our games, you can actually claim free Bybit merch if, you go, if you're going to watch our games for free and for and live games. So yeah, make sure to watch our games. And yeah, I'll see you guys there at Makini Stadium. And also, siguro just one last plug then, make sure to check out our Gaps Crypto 101 playlist tutorial videos because if let's say you want to learn how to trade those short-term indicators that I showed you 
you can actually check out this free Crypto 101 playlist and you can find it guys in the description down below. But anyway, I'm gonna quick update for the time being. If you find this video useful and informative, please give this video a like. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye for now.